I have a spreadsheet here that has hundreds and hundreds of rows of numbers. The problem is, though, that there are several blank rows in between these numbers, and I want to get rid of these. But right-clicking on every single row individually and choosing Delete is just going to take far too long. So how can I select all of the blank rows in one go and then delete them in one go? In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So I'll show you how to delete every single blank row in your spreadsheet in just three seconds. So you can see in this uh, spreadsheet here, I have several hundred rows. I think it's something like about 620 different rows um, of numbers, and some of them contain numbers, but a lot of them contain blank rows. And getting rid of those blank rows is really important. Uh, if your data is going to um, include formulas and functions, that makes sense. So how can you easily select all of the blank rows? Well, you could manually right click on every single row and choose delete. You could click on each row and then hold the control button down and select multiple rows. But the problem is this is still going to take an awful long time. I have 600 rows. You could have several thousand rows and it would take you an age. Fortunately, there is a very quick way of doing this that will take you no more than three seconds. It'll probably take you less than that, but um, I'll show you step by step exactly what's going on here. The first thing that we would need to do is to select the data that this applies to. Now, this could be the entire spreadsheet. In this case, it is. I've got, as uh, I say, something like 600 rows zooming out there so you can see all this data here. So I've got about 600 rows, uh, but you might equally just have 20 rows or something. But you're either going to select manually the data by doing that, or if it's the whole spreadsheet, simply click the button at the top left corner here to the left of A and above the 1. Clicking on that selects the whole spreadsheet. So once you've selected the table, the data, or the whole sheet, the next thing to do is to press the F5 key. The F5 key is at the top of your keyboard. I don't mean typing the letter F and then the number 5. That might sound stupid, but it's surprising how many people um, don't always realise that. So it's the F5 key at the top of your keyboard, and this brings up the Go To uh, panel. Now, not to do anything here, just click on the Special button. Uh, which is also labelled special, funny enough. Uh, click on special at the bottom left, and then when you get this panel pop up, choose blanks just here. So click OK once you've selected blanks, and what this will do is it will automatically find all of the blank rows in either your selected data or your uh, spreadsheet. So now we've got all of the blank rows selected, the next thing to do is in the Home tab to head along towards the right hand side where you have the Delete button here. You might not see this if your copy of Excel is not maximized. If you're looking at Excel uh, where it is just filling half the screen, say, you may not see some of these buttons on the right hand side so it's probably a good idea if you maximize your uh, application so you can see this button uh, once you found the delete button click on the little arrow underneath it and then what you're looking for is to delete sheet rows this will delete all of the rows that have been selected and of course in this case that's all the blank rows so i click delete sheet rows and instantly, all of the blank rows in my spreadsheet have vanished. You can see, scrolling down, every single one has disappeared. That is a heck of a lot quicker, I think, than doing something manually. I'm just going to undo, undo all the zooms there as well, just undo, there we are, undo this so we're back to where we were before, just to show you how quick this is. So here I have all of the 
data with the blank rows on it, 600 odd rows of data with various blank rows in between. So now I'm going to get rid of those blank rows. Click one, two, three, and then delete rows. Simple as that. So I hope that was useful for you. Hope you found that useful. Um, it certainly is a huge time saver. If you liked this video, please do give it a thumbs up before you go. And there are lots more useful videos like this on the channel. So uh, maybe consider subscribing. And of course, it would be terrific if you could share this video as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next tutorial.